On the 30th of January in the afternoon, a shooter, allegedly a minor named Ram Bhakt Gopal Sharma actually hid a revolver in his jacket and fired at anti-CEA protesters outside of Jamia University on a Thursday afternoon. Now, this alleged 17-year-old schoolboy left home in the morning saying he was going to school in Jevar in Uttar Pradesh and instead of going to school, apparently landed up at the protest with a gun in his jacket. He whipped out that pistol and caused chaos and fired one shot, uh, leaving a Jamia student, Shadab Farooq, injured. We saw visuals of uh, Shadab having to climb over four police barricades uh, to actually be taken to the hospital after he was shot. But what happened after that was very interesting. The same day, news agency ANI tweeted a CBSC senior secondary exam certificate, a mark sheet, saying that the individual shooter, the gunman, was in fact, based on that mark sheet, 17 years old. The mark sheet, uh, you know, the date of birth on the mark sheet actually was April 8th, 2002, and hence he's a minor. And that will make a big difference to how he is tried and what punishment he will have to face if he's under 18. So his age became a big question. And uh, there was a lot of questions about whether the mark sheet was in fact authentic and where it came from to help us actually figure out what this mark sheet is. Uh, I have with me a journalist from Boom, Archis Chaudhary has been looking specifically into that mark sheet. Uh, Could you tell us how it came up? Uh, so yeah, I mean, just, just before like the confusion spread because immediately after the event happened, hmm. ANI put out a tweet citing Delhi police saying that this person is 19 years old. Yes. And in 35, 40 minutes, yes. uh, they put out the mark sheet which said that he's 17, yes. shy of turning 18. So uh, the mark sheet was with the father. Mm -hmm. So ANI sent a reporter to the father and uh, in Jaywar as soon as they got the address. And uh, this is the person who confirmed that the mark sheet is actually belongs to this person. Yes. Uh, and because ANI didn't put out any courage and them, uh, you know, referring to their previous tweet, people got very confused why there are two conflicting uh, claims by ANI. Yes. And you know, this is interesting. And I'll tell you why it's interesting because Things change very drastically if the individual is a minor. Yeah, don't they? That's Could you true. tell us what the difference is? Uh, yeah, of course. So in this case, uh, it's uh, an attempt to murder. Hmm. If the person was a minor, the max uh, the person would serve here is uh, three years. Is the max a minor serves anyway? In yes. this case, would be around ten months. And uh, so, but if this person uh, was not a minor adult, ten years is what we're looking at for a crime like this. Wow. So it's it's quite a difference. It's, it's substantial. So yeah. basically the whole argument is about whether or not this individual is going to serve 10 years likely in, in prison because mm -hmm. obviously he did it. Uh, there's enough evidence. That's yeah. a fairly, from an investigation point of view, it's open and shut. That's so it's true. just a question of whether he's a minor or he's not a whether minor. Whether he will be tried as a minor or an adult. Whether he'll be question. tried as a minor or an adult. Exactly. And here's the question. And I know that you've been making some phone calls on behalf of Boom as well. Mm -hmm. It's not, is the CBSC certificate, and a lot of people are still asking whether it's, you know, it's real or it's fudged or whatever. Yeah. Let's assume for argument's sake it's real, mm -hmm. right? Let's assume this individual was studying in CBSC and did do remarkably well in his English and his Hindi papers, according yeah. to that mark sheet. <laughs> <True>. <laughs> not so good with maths though. No. <laughs> <laughs> Let's assume this is real. Mm -hmm. Is this enough proof for him to be tried as a, as a minor? That's a very grey area. Now, we know that uh, the mark sheet itself is not very conclusive in terms of birth dates or you know date of birth uh, because a lot of time it happens that we change our date of birth at registration you know that could lead to this this discrepancy uh, so I mean uh, it, it's it's not like we have any information from Delhi police confirming whether they would go mm. and pursue this and check uh, this person's birth certificate yes. so uh, it is possible that his birth certificate will be pulled out uh, I mean if there's a doubt about the date of birth mm. on the mark sheet itself mm. But yeah, at, at this point, uh, truth be told, we're just not sure yet, you know, like we're just waiting for these information to come out and we're waiting for Delhi police to you know, give, a, give us something, you know. Yeah, to give us yeah. something. And, and um, has there been, there, there have been, there's been a, perhaps a statement from the Vishwa Hindu Parishad who sort of like said that we've encouraged him to do this or we, or we applaud him for doing this. So there's some yeah. grey area as to whether this was premeditated yeah. or whether... Bajram that has also given out a statement because he had... Uh, post, posted photos with Bajrangdal members in Bajrangdal rallies, you know, and they wanted to distance himself. Uh, and then, but on social media, we are looking at something else. We are saying we are seeing like encouragement, you know, words of praise. So it's very confusing hmm. for all of us, for our users, and you know, for fact checkers as well as to like what's really happening here. 
and uh, and yeah and uh, as far as this person is concerned whether he'll be tried as an adult or a minor also remains to be seen because mm. it's possible given the, the conditions like all the conditions that has happened it is possible this person can be tried as an adult and i just spoke to a lawyer who confirmed like all the different conditions required so yeah i mean it's what are the different conditions required uh, so it has to be a heinous crime in this mm. case it uh, is. attempt to murder is a heinous yes. crime uh, secondly the person and uh, there has to be like without uh, like beyond any doubt that this person was aware of his or her actions or the consequences of his or her actions so i guess they would they would involve psychologist in this uh, another one uh, the lawyer told me is if the person is close to turning 18 it is possible that this person can be tried as an adult and this is fairly close this is 2 months away 3 yeah, months exactly. away yeah yeah so, uh, so again it remains to be seen what actually happens so we know that it can be uh, it can happen that this person can be tried as an adult but uh, i do want to ask you about the certificate now yeah. we are in a country where our prime minister's mm -hmm. sort of delhi university certificate has not been found yeah <laughs> so uh, the question of the veracity of certificates also mm -hmm. becomes difficult and i know that this has been a challenge at boom as well mm -hmm. because this question of whether this certificate is authentic yeah. or not hmm. is actually very difficult to crack isn't it yeah so uh, the uh, i mean we have not independently verified the authenticity of the certificate we haven't sent anyone to the to the uh, parents place but uh, three diverse news organizations times fact check ani and reuters had confirmed with the school principal and with cbse that the mark sheet is in fact authentic and uh, so we are taking this at face yeah, value yeah, now yeah. so like we have enough uh, you know like proof that yeah. this can actually be authentic but if you were to be if if you were to verify this hmm. uh, you would have to actually physically send someone to the school to check the school records that's right that's, that's how right. one yeah. that's how one would verify a certificate exactly. uh, like exactly. this and so you can also call cbsc and uh, you know get the details from them and they can confirm that as well provided they don't reject it uh, for privacy yeah details. i mean yeah of course there's, <laughs> that. <laughs> there's that all right if you have other stories you want us to take a look at the contact details are on your screen you can get in touch with us and we will be happy to break down stories for you right here on truth be told uh, that brings us to the end of this show but remember for all news and verified news look at boomlive.in thanks for watching